Hey everybody and welcome back to Nightbringer's Watch. I'm your host Fuck, and tonight we are continuing our way here through Neverwinter Nights. Um, last time we made it through the Beggar's Nest, and uh, we slay so many zombies due to Dalen running off and fighting like the whole district. Um, and now we are uh, in the Shining Serpent, uh, the tavern that was mentioned uh, from so many characters before and here are some patrons and re mostly refugees and there's a guy named Kalen uh, to which we will talk and there's Drake Drake is a name that sounds something familiar I don't know where we heard that and there's Harm Ashen Smith of course to which we will talk uh, to whom, whom we will talk um, let's first start with Callahan. So, not much information from Callahan other than there's some thing uh, in the graveyard, some sanctuary or something, he, he called it, um, that we should mm, visit at some point, I think, because that may uh, tie to the story that we started in the prison district uh, before where we gone to this whatever old graveyard thing with special artifacts and whatever and um, that this Drake is a undead hunter and maybe we should talk to Drake Okay, so we have already talked with Gemini and we have a key. And um, that may be uh, helpful, so let's uh, talk You're again. Return to me. You need me to repeat my earlier information or have you something else? Hmm. Have you found any new information? A further thing or two about a snake cult? Though you probably already know this. It was probably your efforts that brought this information to light. Forgive me if I repeat something you know all too well. Tell me about this snake cult. An organization of malevolent fanatics following someone named Gulnan. They are en entrenched in an estate in the northwest uh, of the Burger's Nest. She will have uh, needed access to the cult, so there may be passages that lead to her or her lay a lair her she who you know the area now so you will spearhead the effort she has taken advantage of a plague ravaged city and must be stopped uh i will continue my investigations if you learn anything keep us informed we must know what we are dealing with and if it's connected to the plague yeah, yeah. okay uh so uh, Drake told us about two lands, uh, Gemini and Crystal, and we already found Gemini. And uh, now we should help Crystal. That's the request from uh, Drake. And that we should talk to Ashen Hammersmith, because Ashen Hammersmith may reward us. So, uh,. Since you know me now a bit, and you know that I'm always up for loot and rewards, uh, let's talk to Harm Ashen Smith. Speak up, speak up. I can't spend much time on pleasantries right now. Too much to do. <sighs> Fuck Nightbringer is my name. I'm helping Erebeth. That's you? I expected green recruits, but I've heard how you've been helping find those blasted Watherdavian creatures already. Glad you've come. It's a meth in here right now. We've got a zombie infestation and it will be your job to root out what's behind it. I heard some things about the local colors and such. Don't know too much, but it seems they are a concern. I may say something you already know. I can only repeat what the guards have heard. Some of this you probably did yourself. Uh, yeah. Um, tell me about this local cult. A boy named Gemini suspects a local cult has something to do with the undead. He claims some sort of creature keeps their estate safe from the zombies. 
cross, he may just be worried about his brother and I can't spare anyone to investigate the estate. It's in the northwest if you want to look. Okay, then go over the basic rundown of the area. We've been up to our necks in Undead. Even deeper for short folk like me. The baby's nest is just a mess, it is. Uh, are the Undead linked to the plague? When did this start? Don't know if the two are linked. Not all plague victims become undead, but the ones that do hardly hit the ground before rising. The plague was here before the zombies though, and it was only a few days ago that the undead became a horde. Ah uh, yeah, that may be the effect of the water diving creatures that went astray. Is there an identifiable uh, enemy behind this? I wish I knew. Like I said, that will be your job. You find out who's behind this and take him out. There are rumors, sure, but nothing makes such uh, makes much sense right now, and I don't have time to talk to everyone. Um, back to my other questions. Mm -hmm. Who are you? What is your role here? Me, Harm Ashensmith. I just have a bit of unofficial rank because the people around here respect me. I did some things in the old days and made a few friends. Someone had to step up and help. I may not have a uniform, but I get things done. Now, what's on your mind? Uh, do you know anything about the Waterdavian creatures? Every path has you chasing those things, hmm? Well, don't blab it around to everyone if people hear that we lost a shot at the cure. I'm sorry, but I don't know where those things might have gone, and I ain't even sure what they were. I got zombies to worry about now. Okay. Uh, if I find out anything, I'll let you know. Here's the thing. I know you're just supposed to keep the peace, but we're up against a wall here. Uh, you find out what's happening, and I'll make it worth your while, over and above whatever Erebeth wants from you. So off you go then, and make sure you talk to Drake if you haven't. He's an undead hunter from way back. Okay. So, uh... Not much, uh, not many more informations we all uh, didn't already know, but uh, as I expected, ha uh, Ashen Hammersmith will reward us if we help um, eradicate the cult. And um, I think we will go and try to. Uh, find the second dude that may have uh, new information for us and then we will return to the Shining Serpent. Mm, I'm not sure if I want to go into the temple but maybe we uh, will be healed in there. But I think I'll first uh, go into whatever uh, house I find. Invisibility. Oh, cool. That's handy for uh, for a rogue like me. And the chain shirt. Oh, that's heavy. We will sell that at a, at a point. Hector. Here's Hector. And some dead in the back. Now let's talk to Hector. Okay, then. <laughs> I guess we have to find Alu and dead. Isn't this a wheel? A not broke wheel? Uh, let's hit the bookshelf. What do we have? Uthgar's legacy and official... Oh, official documents. I'll let Uthgar's legacy stay, and but I will read uh, the official document. This document seems to be official. The Vex stand with what appears to be the official seal of Lord Nasher and the delicately written script spelling out a friendly endorsement for one Hayden Lord Fraidling. It appears to prove that Mr. Fraidling worked as a coachman in Muran for the entire duration of the previous year and so couldn't possibly have been imprisoned in the city of Callanport for an unmentioned crime. Several words are poorly spelled and the uh, ink smudged uh, badly in numerous spots, making the qu quality of this obvious forgery rather questionable. Mm, I think we should keep on to those. Okay, so, well, uh, uh, 
we talk to Hector. Hector is a dump and wants to punch the plague like he punches zombies. And now uh, we agree to find Mr. Aldo uh, for uh, who he is trying to gather parts for a wagon. So Mr. Aldo can um, bring his stuff to safety. Okay, what do we have up here? Yes. Much open space here and so many doors. I have and there's a patriot the guard. Okay, this is locked. This is I also locked. In the task. Okay, are they just guarding towers or something like that. This door's barred from the other side. Okay, I think all will be barred. We let the guard left alone. Okay, there's not much up here. So let's hit the other side first and then let's go into the central part. There's another barricaded home here on the map, so I think that's the home of the dude we are looking for. Um, but we have Hector with us, so maybe we should first... Oh, here's a dead end. And uh, down there are some weak zombies. Um, we should first find Mr. Aldo. Hmm. There's... Oh, there's a chest. There's an open chest and there's a box. Cool. I want to have the gold and yeah, I'll also take the bullets. There's a crate. Let's open the crate. There's so some more gold. Up there's a chest and a barrel. I'll open the barrel first. I like opening things and finding stuff. Chest is also open, so let's just take the gold. Okay, we've opened these things as best as we can do. There's the barricaded home. Uh, there's another. Oh, yeah, yeah, they did. We, we kill the zombies. Okay. Oh, there's a full wagon. Hmm. Let's see. Just the healer's kit. Okay. Can we... Can we burn the spire? Okay. We set this ablaze. Uh, should we open this door? This goes to the Neverwinter Academy. Ah, okay. Uh, I'll make sure to visit the Neverwinter Academy at some point. But first, let's try to... Ah, here. Here's Mr. Aldo. Oh, they're fleeing. And now? Did we gain XP for that? Oh, a hundred. Uh. Okay, not that much. Okay, so we are close to the Neverwinter Academy and here are some more houses and there's a... Oh, it's an open chest. Just uh, some diamond thing. And a house full of zombies. Uh, and there's a crate, so... Kill the zombies, loot the crate. I wonder if we could fall ill due to the zombies. Hmm. Doesn't look like. Okay, only some arrows. It's not that much. So let's head out. 
Anything else I want to enter? Ah, here, this house. Let's enter this house. Olga! Okay, let's talk to Holga. Okay, there are no information from Holga that we need to know about it. Oh, there has been a chest of drawers, so let's enter again and yes. oh. Is there hmm. something you No, I don't want to talk to you. I'll take the healer's kit. Thank you, bye. Um, okay, it's time to enter the barricaded home. And talk to the second dude. Oh, ah, there's a zombie. You won't have me! Come on. Okay. Zombie is dead, gone, and anything we can grab. That is great. And we can go upstairs. So, Tom, person, or animal. Okay. Uh, we can't. Read the notes. More zombies, okay. And there's Crystal next to the zombie. Okay. Let's first open the cabinet and chest. There's some gold. A club plus one. Okay. I think I'll sell this. Uh, let's talk to Crystal. Okay. So, we talked to Crystal, this draw fellow here, who has a beard in, in the picture, but no beard at all. Um, and he has been part of the Salt Coast Boys, and we found out that the leader made a pact with some uh, something that empowered him and lets him control the zombies. So let's head back into the uh, Shining Serpent and talk to uh, Ash and Hammersmith and Drake to get some more information. <laughs> Zombie. Okay, first Drake. Okay. So we got some more new information, the uh, base of those... Oh, Thomas Rewrite Wagon Repair. What? Should we have gone there to... Hmm. Oh, a chest. Um, yeah, we got some more information, because the... A hideout of Drake and his gang is in I can't the uh, it's too heavy. north of the Beggar's Nest. So somewhere at the graveyard, I think. And I think we should um yeah should go to the graveyard. So I'll go and sell those heavy, heavy things I have in the inventory and then I'll see you in a second at the north of the beggar's nest. Ah, before I head back into the... to the beggar's nest. See, we are... The, the guard dog is near death, but the guard dog is okay. Uh, I'll befriend it, the guard dog, without Dalen uh, following me, so... Uh, Dalen did not attack the guard dog um, and I could befriend the dog again and it even followed me for a while before I send it back um, so it can once more guard the house which we will enter at some point but okay now uh, back to the beggar's nest and there we are again in the beggar's nest and what's this weak zombies so let's kill them before we... Oh, we need to go through the properties of the academy to go into this north part. Did it just stay there? 
instead of attacking. Oh, another chest. Should I open this chest and these barrels? And is this the gang house? Oh, a potion. That's nice. Some more bullets and a melachit. Uh, let's open this. What is it? Where? Ah, it's the warehouse. So it is uh, the gang hideout. Can we can we go into stealth already and enter then? Yeah, we can. Okay. But the zombies close to that, and there are appearing more zombies from Taste everywhere. Fury. Yeah, I'll follow you, Dylan, to the left side. No more zombies on the left, so let's kill them. Or kill those that appear from the right side. Oh. Okay. That's it, but there's a door downwards. Um, let's loot first everything here. Only some zombies. Not worth really talking about. Open this chest. If you would please. And um, after that, I think we go into the cellar of the house. So many morning zombies here. Mo morning? Morning? And so many potions. That concerns me uh, some somehow. Tells me that it will be dangerous to go out. Uh, to to move any further. Where's that? Negative energy ray. Okay, some more money, there's the other entrance I think, that will lead out somehow, wait, and, ah, yeah, that's the way into the cellar, we open this chest, let's go back into stealth mode, Sounds horrific. Squeaking floors. So many zombies. Okay, first one's down. Second one's down. Ah, okay. Just third one down, and let's attack the fourth. Also down. Where are you running to? Oh god, more zombies. And Dylan goes on a rampage once more. There's so many bookshelves or shelves in general. Not only for books, but for like everything. Not much to, to loot here. Okay. Sounds like a whale or something. Well, except for the <laughs> heart. Oh, there are the zombies. Yeah. Alien's pretty strong. Oh, okay. I'll open the crate. Summon creature. Uh, okay, they didn't. Don't, don't. Oh, follow. Follow. You'll need to heal up first. I shall do as you ask. <sighs> Thank you. Um, Here, take this potion. 
Thank you, and now we can bash some more zombies. Okay. Potion, there's a weak zombie. More weak zombies, and the door. Okay, let's unlock this chest and um huh? let's get into stealth mode before we open this door it's another door and a sword coast boy an uninjured one Yeah, looks like a zombie. Somehow. I attack and Wait, what? Nothing? Weapon in ineffective, okay. Oh. Run faster! Okay, so my weapons do like what? Nothing? Uh, what do I have? I have. Die! Die! cast Soundburst? Oh. We can damage the Sword Cross Boy. But if the Sword Cross Boy hits, it'll damage us. Okay, we got away. Barely. It dropped down. Okay, then we can heal. So I was right, all those potions are not a good omen, after all. So let's scavenge this room. There's only a chest. No notes that would help us. Oh, there's another chest. And a third one, even. Okay, this has a fire agitate, ag agate. We can try to unlock this. Worked well. Oh, these tools. And let's see if we can open this one. Gauntlets unidentified. I'll put them here so I'll. Can I d identify them? on another occasion okay before we continue um i'll end the episode here i uh, thank you all for watching liking shen and subscribing and stay tuned for all the dialogues after the end card and i say bye Well, hello to you. Need a drink. Times is just tough. And the buddy could use a little lubrication to keep it moving. Um. Uh, da, 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 da. I wish I had clear answers about the zombies in this district. I don't blame you. Being crazy around these parts. First to play, then this. We'll all be walking the warrants before we are through. Um. What are the warrants? Sorry, local superstition. The warrants of the dam burying deep beneath the dead to the very dormant of the hells. Okay. 
It's about the crypts beneath the great graveyard. People imagine uh, the worst because they are out of sight. It's nothing. Hmm. Where are the undead coming from? The dying? Seriously, they don't seem concentrated anywhere and people that die of plague seem to rise from uh, where they fall. There's more near the great graveyard in the north. I mean, go figure, the place is full of the dead. Hmm. Is anyone fighting back against the, the undead? Harm Ashen Smith is here, and the celebrated undead hunter Drake. He won my Eat the Most Pickled Eggs Jamboree two years running. He'll deny it, won't even let you uh, ask, but uh, just you think about uh, that when he's being oh so serious. Oh, Dexter's helmets are in the district somewhere too, set up a sanctuary, I think. Okay. I'd better get, uh, get to it, goodbye. Uh, good luck, we'll live through this and we'll tie one on. But then we'll tie another one that uh, to death and watch them twirl. Okay. Ah, I've heard of the impact you are making in Neverwinter. Good to know you are on our side today. I've never seen an infestation like this, undead fester over time, but here they rise before a cops even cools. Uh, I've seen how dangerous the undead can be. What we need right now is some order in the streets. People need help, first and foremost. We need you. Once people are safe, we can find the source of these undead and get down their throats. I'm sure Harbin agrees and will reward people accordingly for helping. Mm, tell me of any people that need immediate help. The lad Crustle and the lad Gemini were spotted uh, barricaded in their homes. More houses may be overrun. Ah, we fought, uh, uh, we, we found Gemini already, but Crystal is something we did not found uh, right now. So let's search for Crystal at some point. Crystal and Gemini may also know of some strange happenings in the area, but we have not been able to interview them as yet. Okay, let's ask about Gemini. Gemini's home is in the west central section of the district. He has a brother too, but I have no news of him. Then tell me of Crystal. This home is in the central east of the district, north of the Helmite Shrine. He's usually with a gang, but they appear to have disappeared. I will look into it. If you learn anything, keep us informed. We must know what we are dealing with, and if it's connected to the plague. It is a long day. I could use a drink. You dead? Hector punch you if you are. No, you are alive. Oh god. <laughs> Hector punch? Are you an imbecile? No, Hector Hulk. <laughs> me, me Hector. Me work for Aldo and work hard. Gotta find wagon parts. But me only find broken stuff. You see any not broken anywhere? Uh, aren't you worried about zombies or plague? Me? Me not scared. Hector punch zombies good and punch plague too if <laughs> it tried to fight me. Oh god. <laughs> Maybe me not see plague before. Me just scared of Aldo. He needs parts for wagons, so me look. Not finding any anywhere, just broken stuff. Uh. <laughs> Perhaps you are too stupid to be scared. Don't matter to me why. Me not scared of zombies and me not scared of you. Me just want parts, so give me or beat it. Sorry, I don't have any wagon parts. All the will be mad. He doesn't want to leave uh, his stuff behind. He sure likes his stuff. Maybe you could uh, come with me to tell him there's no parts. He gets real mad sometimes. Uh... Uh, I'll take you, sure. Where is he? Good, good. Aldo is guarding his wagon in the middle of Beggar's Nest. Uh, just don't let him bug you. He gets mad. Play. You Not just zombies. watch yourself. If you're dead, so help me, I'll make you deader. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. Watch who you threaten, fool. <laughs> <laughs> the dead ones don't talk back, so I guess you are okay. Can't blame a guy for being careful, though. Hey, what are you doing with Hector? Tall fog idiot was supposed to get 
uh, are some wagon parts. I tried boss, ain't no parts somewhere though, I swear to it. Alright, alright, relax, you lower max. Uh, let's just figure out what we do now. Time to abandon ship, our wager. No parts means no wagon, ah uh, well. Thanks for bringing Hector here, friend. I think we'll find our own way out now. No sense staying. Sure, it's a, uh, it's a fine wagon, though I'll miss you, girl. Uh, okay. You're talking to the wagon? I greet you. What do you want here? I've got nothing you couldn't get elsewhere. Please leave me. I need to ask a few questions. I can't stop you asking. Just hurry up so I can I can lock and block the door again. Um, have you heard of anything odd? Any rumors? I haven't left my home in days. Longer, maybe. I don't dare go outside. I'll be dead if I do. I know it. I'm no fighter, no guard. That's the walking dead out there. At least I can see them, I suppose. Not like the plague. Um, anything strange besides the plague and undead then? Never. I never thought I would dare consider there was something more strange than what ha has happened to us here. I guess... I guess there were some odd people, but nobody that would compare uh, to so many dead. A gang, and maybe those Dark Sun followers. Hmm. What are these Dark Sun followers? Shh, they follow Zurich. I stay the heck away from them. The whole lot are uh, out of their minds, just crazy. I hope the plague took them. Not a decent one of the lot. I can't tell you where they were based, and I don't care to know. What do you know about the gang? Salt Coast boys are what they call themselves. Some good children fell uh, in with them. Now they'll end up in stocks. The worst of the lot is Drawl. The rest just babies. I think they spend most of their time in the northwest of the nest. Ah, okay, so they're part of the cult. Huh. Uh, then let's say goodbye and get going. Goodbye then, please try not to leave anything here, plague or otherwise. Hey, okay, yeah. Thank you for your help. I didn't want to end up like them. Uh Where are you safe now? Quit your crying. I ain't safe, they'll come back. Once a sword cost boy, always a sword cost boy, even if you're dead. I wasn't having anything more to do with them, not after what happened to Draw's rivals. Now they are all dead and draw some kind of monster. Who is Drawl? A zombie? No way, Drawl and his lieutenants are worse. I saw them for a second, they ain't lumbering or slow. They look really evil now. He was the leader of our gang, but I don't know who he's dealing with now. I bet he gave uh, over everyone just so he could be powerful. Uh, who did Drawl make a deal with? Who did this? I don't know, at first I thought the heaviest the heaviest had something to do with it. They are a gang of half orcs, but now they are all undead too. Oh, undead half orcs. Oh no. They are all wandering around the warehouse. It's like Draw put them on display, like with all his rivals, making a point. Mm. Who are you to the Salt Coast boys? Me, I'm Crystal. I was just one of the boys. I'm lucky that I'm not important enough to come after. Blake or no, I'd be over the wall if I was. After what Draw did to the others. And how they tracked Walters down after he left. I hope he's alright. I know Draw's rivals ended bad. Mm, what happened to Draw's rivals? Some of the guys, they wanted to try and get the gang out of town while the plague was going on. You know, save their skins. Draw was leader and said everyone should stay. He said he had a deal with a uh, deal that would make the gang really powerful. He wouldn't let anyone leave. Then he changed into something. Now everyone is dead. Zombies but different. And Draw, he's still leading them. Don't know how. He's got a powerful friend somewhere. <laughs> so Draw is with uh, what the Davian creature teams. Uh, I'm leaving. What are you doing now? I ain't going anywhere. I ain't ending up like them. Not even Drawl, if I can help it. Ah, you have returned to me. Do you need me to repeat my earlier information, or have you something else? 
Have you found any new information? I've heard a thing or two about the Sword Coast Boys and a snake cult, though you probably already know this. It was probably your efforts that brought this information to light. Forgive me if I repeat something you know all too well. Tell me about the Sword Coast Boys. Something was corrupting the young. A creature named Gulnan offered power in exchange for complicity. Whoever she is, she will have needed access to the warehouse. Search for passages and take the fight to her lair. <sighs> so sorry. Ah. Uh. Whew. Ah, uh, you know the area now, so you sparehead the efforts. She has taken advantage of Blake Ravage City and must be stopped. Mm. I will continue my investigations. Okay. Then let's talk to Harm Ashen Smith. Back again, hmm? Need a recap? Uh have you had any updates? Any new information? I heard some things about the Sword Coast Boys gang and a little about a local cult or some such. I think they have something to do with the undead. I may say something you already know, I can only repeat what the guards have heard, some of this you probably did yourself. Yeah. But tell us about the Sword Coast Boys. A lad named Crystal fears that the Sword Coast Boys have made a deal with a strange creature, their leader, Drawn, has become a powerful undead. These are alarming tales, but I can't spare anyone to check out the warehouse the gang uses as a base. Perhaps you could? It's in the north, central of the Beggar's Nest. Uh. But take care, Droll has apparently killed off all his rivals, including many of his own gang. Okay. Careful out there, and remember, I'll make your efforts worth your while. 